Kovac and Nia Kovac. Now over to Jeremy Kuna. Buona asifiwe. Amen. Buona asifiwe. Amen. I think that's my trademark, you know? Like when I start, I'll just be doing that. That's a good trademark. Um, so I want to take some time and, um, and remind us of the, the word of the year. The word of the year that my dad said is fruitfulness. So if you have a Bible, I would like for you to go to the, the scripture, Genesis 1.28, and I'd like to read it. It says, Then God blessed them and said, Be fruitful and multiply. And then I'd like to go straight to 29 and say, Then God said, Look, for I have given you every seed-bearing plant, throughout the earth and all the fruit trees for your food. I want us to remember that in, on Sunday, God said that this is the expensive fruit that we have sold. The, the work is still to be completed. And I know that God will be fruitful in this year. I want us to know that my father didn't just leave a legacy, but he left an amazing, amazing job for us to complete. So. Um, I want us to remember that the goal is to always, always glorify God and produce fruit. And God, I come to you and I say, Lord, as we've given you this expensive fruit, let his vision be the, this expensive seed, let his vision be the fruit that we provide. <sighs> and to my father, I love you, I love you, I love you. And uh, we'll make you proud, we'll complete the job. Thank you, Mom Teresia, my girlfriend. I love you, I love you more than anyone. <laughs> I love you, I love you so much. Thank you, Mom. And I want you to know that we stand with you and we are here for you. I love you. Bye. God bless you, Jeremy Kuna. Him and our senior mom call each other boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, Jeremy just graduated from the university the other day and he's beginning his master's degree. Um, and his father was so proud of him. I remember recently when he walked into the room uh, from abroad, he had this special gift for his father, the degree that he had just acquired. And he told his father, I did this for you. And Bishop said something that made me emotional. He said, I am so proud of you, I could never be prouder of you. And he added that even if you did not graduate, I would still be proud of you. What a father we had in our bishop. Now, because of time, the next speakers will take a very short time, the shortest possible, like a minute. On behalf of the